Hi guys, what's up, it's Bella. Welcome to my channel. I am beyond excited for this video. I've done a few of these, but not like this, not like appointment based. So I have a full week of appointments this week just to prepare for Thanksgiving and just the holiday season in general. So every day this week, I'm gonna be taking you guys to all of my appointments and talking about them and kind of just showing the glow up. Today is Monday, November 18th, and I have a nail appointment and also a facial later today. It's 9.32, my nail appointment is 20 minutes away and I need a little Starbucks drink. So so let's go to Starbucks and get a fun drink and you guys are gonna freak out over the nails like they're gonna be so freaking good hi can I do two shots of espresso over ice and a venti cup and then I'll do one pump of mocha syrup in that and a splash of non-fat milk and then I'll do the peppermint chocolate cold foam with chocolate shavings on top does it all look right for you um yes that looks right $5 Thank you. It's so embarrassing ordering a complicated order, but I tried it the other day and it's a very like sugar friendly and like macro friendly Starbucks drink. It's only 90 calories and it's like 10 grams of sugar. And so obviously it's still a treat for me, but it's gonna be freaking good. You guys, I also like never go to Starbucks anymore. So it's definitely a treat for me to do this. Hi. Thank you. Thank you so much. Have a good one. Look how freaking good this looks. Like they actually did it so perfect. I'm so excited. Let's give it a taste test. It's actually so perfect. Like I couldn't get over. It's just perfect. I'm excited. That is literally the best drink. Make sure you go get it. Here is this again for a screenshot. And obviously I said it, but let's go to my nail appointment because I'm 20 minutes away. Inspo. We are doing a beautiful Ferrari red, which is my favorite red, and then we're doing some Is this cheetah or leopard? Cheetah. Cheetah print. And then some cherries, and then of course the almond shape because almond is literally the best. the base here is what it's looking like and now we're about to do the designs so I just do almond she did like a very pointy almond so it looks so good and now on to the fun stuff now you guys can see where Maggie shines obsessed is an understatement you guys look how good these are they're just like the photos, Maggie does the best. This is the first step in the glow up of the week for the holidays. And I have a couple hours until my facial, so I'll see you guys when my facial is starting, which I'm so excited for. Hi guys, it is two hours later. I was working at home and now it is literally three o'clock and my facial is supposed to be starting. I don't know how much footage I'm gonna be able to get because I'm gonna ask her. She can video some stuff for me, but I'm gonna do my best and I will show you at least, I guess, and tell you what I do after the facial. So here's my skin before. It looks a little crazy because I had to like scrub off my mascara, but I'm so excited for my glow. So pumped. particular that you would like my hands. Nope, just keep doing your thing. I can't even lie to you guys, after I got those few clips of the facial, I literally knocked out. Like I could feel myself falling asleep. That was amazing, so good. I can't even make that up. Like literally my aura ring caught my nap for 17 minutes, like confirmed, 100% did nap. And all of this is just from me running around the house. Hey guys, it's been a few hours. I have just been working to make up for the time that I spent for my two appointments today. But I do Oxygeneo facial, that's what I got in derma planning. And I got as much footage as I could, but I ended up falling asleep for 17 minutes. It was just so relaxing. 
but I'm gonna keep working. It is seven o'clock. I have a lot more to do since your girl is a corporate girly and <laughs> runs her parents' company and also does social media for a fun little side job, but like full time at the same time. I've got a lot to do. So I'm excited for tomorrow's appointment. I'm very pumped. It's gonna be a good one. I'm gonna be a little sore in the lips. A little Botox, a little lip filler, a little excitement. I'm so pumped, but I will see you guys tomorrow for that appointment and I love you guys so much. Talk to you guys tomorrow. Hi guys, happy Tuesday. I'm headed to my first and last appointment of today. Sorry guys, I'm literally driving. This is not being a good role model right now. I'm driving and filming. On today's agenda, we have Botox and filler, which I've been doing for a couple years, just have never really like posted about it. I just do it in my forehead. I do Botox in my forehead for my little nervous little thing that I do. When I talk to people, I like raise my eyebrow and I don't do it intentionally. It's just like a little nervous thing that I do. And I've started to do it more and that's how I know Botox is worn off. And then for my lips, I literally just do a very thin filler that just plumps them. It doesn't do any shaping or anything like that. It's not like a really thick one that she would use for like shaping new lips because if you look back at videos when I didn't have anything done two years ago, like I had always gotten questions growing up. Like, do you have lip filler? It's just because I have like really nice lips and like really nice Cupid's bow. But I'm finally gonna take you guys along with me. So that is the first and last appointment of today. I'm headed to the mall after this. So that's why I'm kind of dressed semi-cute. But I'm so excited for you guys to meet Michelle. She has been doing me for the past couple of years and she's literally the best. Hey, oh, you look cute. Thank you. <laughs> My lips are numbing and now we're about to do Botox. She marked all the places for it. So, Botox is first and then we're gonna do some filler. I'm excited. I'm feeling very numb. <laughs> I always drool like when. Me too. Yes, I'm like always drooling after I'm done. Sometimes I don't even know it. Whenever it's so swollen, I look like straight out of a Bratz box. You guys, I am so happy with the way my lips look. They look literally amazing. It's kind of hard to see right now. I'm a little swollen. Beware, they're not gonna like stay exactly like this. Although I like love the swollen look, so I'm totally fine with it. But Michelle and her team are actually phenomenal. I also made a little Instagram reel. And if you're in the Tampa area, I have a code Bella10 and that will get you 10% off your first service with her of anything. She does tons of fun med spa facials, filler, Botox, literally anything. So if you guys are interested, use that code. It's for people who are first time booking and also if you've seen her before. But you guys know I love to support local and help my people out, so be sure to use that code. She's literally the best, and her husband is a plastic surgeon there, and I just think that's such a cool like little mix. But yeah, it was amazing, and I like love my lips. She always does so good. I trust her with my life, like actually. But that is it for the appointments today. I'm gonna head to the mall and then work, and I will see you guys for my appointment tomorrow. Hi guys, it's the next day. Today is my hair appointment, which I'm honestly really excited for. We kind of don't really do much to my hair just because I keep my hair very natural, like I don't do much to it. Typically we just do like a nice like, little cut, like with layers, and then we do like a colored gloss that's the same color as my hair just so it's brightened and really shiny. But I wanted to update my lips, they look so good. I have slight bruising like right here, but they look so good and I've had like no issue. Michelle is literally the best and you guys gotta make sure if you're in the area, you guys can use my code and get that 10% off. Also wearing a jacket I've literally never worn. It's this like Lulu Define jacket and I've never worn it before, but it matches perfect with my billiard that I got in Chicago. So very happy about that. But let's go to my hair appointment. Not sure how much footage I'm gonna get. She doesn't even know I do this. Like she only knows about my big girl job, which is like working for my parents. So it's gonna be really interesting what she thinks and I'm sure she'll be okay with it. So let's go.
done and oh my gosh there is such freaking power in having dark hair i literally love it i'm obsessed it is perfect we didn't do a cut today because i didn't feel like i needed it but i'm gonna go back in eight weeks and we're gonna do everything we just did plus a little haircut but i love it and that is the only appointment for today i will see you guys tomorrow for my next appointment but so happy with how this glow up transformation is working out it looks so good very happy Hi guys, welcome to the very last day of our maintenance vlog. I am so excited for today. It is the last day, which makes me a little sad because this was so much fun, but I definitely want to do more of these in the future. Today is literally just a pedicure because I really like the lady that does my pedicures and I just do gel. I do gel white. I keep it very simple and my toes last me like a month and a half when I do it, so I don't do them too often. But I am definitely sad that it's the last day of the vlog because it's been so much fun. I've been making tons of like short form content throughout this whole process of doing my maintenance stuff. So definitely make sure you're following my other social medias. But let's go get our toes done. Our nails are done, but our toes are not done. So that makes me feel a little incomplete. Also lip update. They're literally looking perfect. Like I'm obsessed. They look so natural, which is the best. <laughs> Okay, I just finished with my toes and they look so good. Let me show you. Free toe content. I love a good white gel pedicure. It's actually my favorite. Thank you guys for coming along with me on this little maintenance vlog this week. It was a lot. It was very expensive, but I only do this like not too often. Like I only do a facial like once a month and I obviously like only do my hair like every 10 weeks because it doesn't take much for me to maintain my dark hair. Also filler and Botox, that's like maybe every six months is filler or every six months is Botox and like once a year is filler. So it was definitely expensive week, but it's worth it because it'll all last me a hot minute. But I love you guys so much. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to check out all of my other content and stay tuned for some future videos because it only gets better from here. I love you guys so much. And my quote of the day is is do not continue to harbor thoughts about people that are just not valid anymore. If someone did something to you a year ago, you just have to try to think that a year ago you were a different person, so maybe they are too now. Give them the benefit of the doubt. Do not harbor bad feelings because when you do that, it only creates bitterness in your heart and makes you the bad person. So think on that. I love you guys so much, and I'll see you guys in my very next video. Bye.